This is one of the biggest searches. Where can I buy a cheap Reese and Muller? And there are options to buy a cheap Reese and Muller. Most of that is around buying a second-hand one, um, you know, on sites like eBay. But you don't tend to find them on there. So Reese and Muller in the UK are relatively small, so they sell probably about 1,500 bikes a year. So the likelihood of you finding your bike that you wanted second-hand um, is pretty slim. So buying a cheap Reese and Muller is probably not something that you're going to find. People often ask um, how far from the shop can we deliver? Um, we do free delivery within an hour and a half of our shop. Any further than that there's a small charge to go with it. But what we can do is deliver your bike in our van with our mechanic and do the setup and the handover of your bike. So we'll have the saddle set up in the right place, brake levers, brake, brake reach, suspension pressures, um, and we'll go through all the paperwork. We'll show you how to register the warranty and show you how to make the um, displays work and find everything you want. Uh, we've delivered bikes anywhere from Plymouth to Inverness. The reason you should buy your bike from us is because we are focused on finding the best bike for you. So we don't tend to hold stock of bikes um, here. So we have a showroom full of sort of 15 to 20 um, display models um, that are available for you to look at and to try. Um, but when it comes to your bike, Reeson will have around about 12,000 different options of the bike. So the likelihood of you turning up to a shop and finding the bike that you want there is not very likely. Buy your bike from us because we don't have a big stock of bikes out the back and a salesman who is told to shift those to the person that comes through the door. Our job is to find the best bike for you and then to get it ordered from the factory. And I'm so confident that when your bike is brought from the factory to you, if we hand it over and you say it's the wrong size or I just don't like it, then just be honest and tell me. I'll take the bike back and put it into our stock and we'll reorder a bike that would suit you. A lot of people when they're looking to buy their electric bikes um, consider the different options for buying it. Things like cycle to work schemes um, are often a good one, um, but people also ask whether they can buy it through their business. Now, I am not an accountant, so um, this is not professional advice, um, but a lot of people look at um, having it as a cargo bike or a business asset. Um, the benefit of doing that is that if you're VAT registered, you can reclaim your VAT as it comes through. So it's definitely an opportunity um, to do something like that. But first of all, make sure you speak to your accountant. So a Reese and Muller um, bike comes with a Bosch battery motor and display on it. And Bosch offer as standard a two year warranty or a 500 charge cycle uh, warranty, whichever one comes earliest. If you imagine you're gonna get about 50 miles from one charge of the battery, then that's gonna be about 25,000 miles or two years. So you're likely to get to the two years first. Um, if your battery fails at any time within that, which is highly unlikely, then we just claim a new one through Bosch and they ship it out to us to fit onto your bike. If you should have to buy a new one for any reason, they're not cheap and there's no getting away from it. You're gonna be looking at 600 to 800 pounds to replace a battery, but based on the numbers we've just given you of sort of 25,000 miles, two years, um, it's highly unlikely that you're gonna wear your battery out. The important one on this is no, it's not. So, the, the things that have changed in the industry over the last years um, really is going to be the form factor, so the, the shape of the battery. So instead of now having batteries that sit on the frame, we've managed to get batteries that sit in the frame. It's still exactly the same lithium-ion cells that they're using. There has been an update to the motor uh, from Bosch to a Gen 4 motor with a slightly more torque. Um, but you wouldn't notice that you know the difference to a, six, a 75 newton meter motor that's been used for the last sort of six or seven years. So don't imagine that the technology is moving rapidly and everything is disappearing. We're still using the same technology that we were five or ten years ago, just packaged slightly better. The quick answer is no on that. The reason that we don't discount is that we help you um, build every single bike specifically to what you're after. So it's not like we have a big pile that we need to get rid of. Um, we're all about finding the right bike for you and having that ordered from the factory. When we're having factory ordered bikes, there's obviously a lead time that goes with them. Um, and people are sometimes nervous about the, the length of time it can take um, to build their bike. 
As a target, Ries and Muller aim for four to six weeks. Um, at the moment, we're looking a little bit longer than that. So what we try to do is we know the very best bikes using our expertise of having chosen bikes um, in the past. And we do order in stock of those very best bikes. If we have the discussion and we find that, you know, you're, you, we've got a bike that fits your needs, there is a possibility that we'll have it in stock. But normally we will be guiding you towards a factory, um, factory order for your bike. One of the biggest concerns people have uh, with their electric bikes is that they will get stolen. Um, in reality, that hardly ever happens. Um, most people's electric bikes are absolutely fine. They, as standard, recent will um, supply them with a lock anyway. So it might be a, a more basic lock that drops through the wheel to stop somebody riding it off. Uh, there's chain extensions to go for those, so you can lock them to a lamppost. Or some of the more expensive bikes have a, an Abbas folding Bordeaux lock, uh, which is quite a beefy lock, so you can uh, fix it to stuff. If you're really concerned about your um, bike being stolen, then you can get um, combinations of locks and insurance um, to, to give you the confidence um, your bike is still going to be there. When it comes to insuring your bike, there's a few different ways of doing it. Um, I would definitely recommend um, putting on your house contents insurance if you're allowed. Um, it's probably the cheapest way of doing it. If you can't do that, my second option would be to go and get new house insurance and put it on the contents insurance then. Um, and if you don't want to do that, then the, the last option would be to go and buy um, bike specific insurance. But it can be quite expensive because they do want to insure you basically fully comp, uh, like on a car. The process is pretty simple. You pick up the phone and give us a call. We'll run through the um, specification with you. If you haven't decided, we'll help you choose that bike. Then we'll produce you a quotation. And if you're happy with that, we ask for a 20% deposit and we will get your order placed with the, the factory. Once that bike has arrived here, uh, we'll give you a call and book in a delivery slot and we'll send you an invoice for the last 80%. So hopefully having seen everything that uh, we've given you, give us a call, I can give you a hand and I can find you the perfect bike.